Okay, we finished uh, putting our body together. We have the fins on, we have the launch lug on, we have the motor mount in, we've got good fillets on our, all of our fins and our launch lug and it's all nice and tight. And I prepared my nose cone. Now we're just gonna put the whole rocket together. And to do that, you're gonna need your rocket, your nose cone, you're gonna need a paper clip and you're gonna need a little bit of this wood glue too. So the first thing we're gonna have to do is get this shock cord back through the coming out the top of the rocket because we pulled it out the bottom because it was easier to assemble it now it's kind of tough to push this thread through there this shock cord through there so i've discovered an easier way to put the shock cord through there is to take your paper clip and make put your shock cord through the paper clip so you've got to just a little loop with your paper clip So just take your paper clip, put it on the end here and feed that through and let the paper clip just pull this all through. There you go, when the paper clip comes out the other end, you pull it out and there's your rocket with your shock cord coming out the top. All right, that's all good. Now we just need to attach that to the nose cone. And so you're just gonna take your Shock cord, you're gonna slide it through the loopy part of the nose cone. This can be kind of tricky to do sometimes, but just get it until it comes through there. Okay, so I've got my cord on there. Now you wanna tie a really nice square knot on that. So you're gonna take the right hand side, go over the left, pull it really tight, and take the left hand side and go over the right, and pull it good and tight. Uh, now this Kevlar always likes to come loose. That doesn't the knots tend to come out of it. So then you want to take your wood glue here, put a little drop of your wood glue on there. So you got a drop of wood glue on there, and then just rub it into the knot. Uh, so the knot's gonna not come undone. Great. Well now we've got our nose cone and our shock cord, but we need a place to attach either our parachute or our streamer to. And so we need a loop to do that. So, that, so in order to do that, we're gonna make an overhand loop. Uh, and I'll show you how to do this on the big one in a minute, but you wanna make a loop. And you want a pretty big loop so when you're done so that's easy to attach to. So just take, oh, I don't know, a couple inches from the back, um, make a, uh, pull the strings parallel here of your shock cord, uh, come around the top, come underneath and make a loop. And make sure that loop is, you know, it's about that big. It needs to be fairly big because we're gonna attach a bunch of different things to it. And just pull that tight. And now you have your shock cord and you have your body tube and you have your nose cone and your rocket's pretty much all assembled here. Um, just take your um, shock cord and shove it down the, the body tube. Put your nose cone on, and there you go. We have a rocket.